Hey guys, so today I want to talk to you about feedback forms and AWS Lambda. So I have this project um, where I dockerized it recently where I can take feedback and uh, send it to me by, by um, AWS ES. Um, I'm quite proud of it because, because you can actually disable JavaScript and it will still work. Disable JavaScript. And we're going to keep the fee. Uber. Let's go ahead of YouTube. So, yeah, um, I'm pretty proud of it. But um, I've noticed that I've been getting increasingly a, a large amount of spam, as you can see here. Um, shoe lifts, uh, credit loan checks, some drugs, I guess. Um, uh, you have a very nice website. I'm not too sure of the idea with that one. Um, so yeah, it does work. Oops, I need to remove that key now. <laughs> so, um, but the other aspect of it is that um, when when you do enable JavaScript, it does a fetch, which um, which doesn't work on Safari and uh, and a lot of browsers, uh, except the latest ones. But the cool thing is, um, it's definitely stopped spammers because I haven't seen any spam this way. So if I'm gonna disable this uh, form data stuff, I might as well just go for AWS Lambda. So come along, let's quickly AWS lambda -ify my feedback script thing, okay? Here we do it, let's do this, let's do this. So just so you know, I already have a verified email address somewhere. Um, da, 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 it's it's called, uh, uh, okay, so you can't, I hate how you can't do it in Singapore, you have to do it in Oregon. US West 2. And yeah, I have I have this one called, just to, you need to do this, right? You need to do Rojack. You need to verify an address. Um, okay, now we go to, uh, I think we need to do Lambda first. So we, you're gonna do also API Gateway. So let's set it up, show it. I have already have one. I think I might go for the Hello World one. Just wanna get basic guys. I'm gonna call it Mail Me. Um, mails Me. Mails Me. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, is this even Node.js? Hmm, why is it showing me Python code? Okay, it doesn't really matter. Let's nuke this, and I've already got something here. Uh, I'll link to that, I guess. So, I like how you don't have to use AWS keys right here. That's a relief. Um, but what, what, what it's doing is, to be honest, I don't really understand this bit, but it's basically taking, it's basically just sending mail with the event that comes into it and all I'm doing is stringifying the event as the body is of the message and sending a, a boring subject and sending it to me. Okay, let's just go go with it, shall we? Let's go with it. Correct errors. I don't see any errors, guys. Put this aircon back on. It's getting too hot. I don't need a VPC. What is the problem, guys? I don't see a problem. Maybe it's, it is something. This is the problem, no doubt. Real.
whatever. Okay. <sighs> oh, whatever. Uh, what is the difference in Node.js and 4.3? I don't know. Let's test it. It should, it should just echo. Yeah, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Oh god, we gotta get the permissions right. Oh, I hate this stuff. I see a send in email. Okay, that was simple. Oh yeah, let's close the tab. I need it. Watch logs. Oh, gosh, push. Probably want that, even though I can't see what it is. Let's put a okay, I'm just putting both. Too lazy here. Okay, let's try that again. Now you're gonna work. Yay, it works. So she gets something lame. Yay, it works. Right, so now I need to do some API gateway magicals. With magic marker. Okay, um, new API. Mail me. Create method post. So we're posting the message. Um, oh, crappy. Crappy dappy. Mail me. Okay, I think it's done. I think I need to add some calls to it. Um, this allows me to execute from anywhere. Um, you should probably just link it to the website where you're submitting your feedback to, but um, calls just makes things work. You can't really think of it as a security thing. It just allows you to drop permissions in the browser. I think I think of the security thing as being the API keys or something, or the usage plans. You can throttle it. Okay, now let's test it, shall we? Request party. That looks good. That looks good. No. Okay, so. I think that looks good. I expect another e an email. Yay! Um, so next, I need to publish it or something like that. Deploy it API. Uh, yeah, whatever. So um, maybe you guys can help me out here because I don't really understand how you get a nice URL yet. I don't understand. Let's, see. Let's add those things. See, this is where you can add throttling. So. So yeah, I don't want anyone to send me more than one message a second, I'd say. I'm not sure what burst means. And client certificate, mm, I, I'm not sure what that means. CloudWatch logs role ARN must be set. Okay, um, 
Never mind. Let's just get this going. We'll do Cloud Watch another day. Um, I'm not too sure what stage variables. I think you, this is how you pass the headers through. Okay, let's just try this thing. What did I call this thing? I called it prod. Weird. Oh, sorry. It's a post. That looks good. That looks good. I like that. Okay, so now. Now I need to update my code. Come on. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, so. Um, okay, I have the thing. I've got it going. Uh, the main name. What's a certificate? Why? Okay, I'll do the um, cloud watch another day. Just getting quickly going, guys. Let's get quickly going. Oh, no, I forgot the URL. What's up here? So let's go into my my thing page. Hmm. Some templates, I guess. <laughs> what? Oh man. So it's reading in the old scripts. So, one thing I learned the hard way is the API gateway doesn't support form data. So, what does that mean? We, instead, we create an, uh, an object. And then we uh, JSON of JSON stringify it string with magic marker input name. I think that should work. Hopefully I haven't made a boo-boo. So, oh, and now we need to um, update the URL here. What was it again? I'm gonna change it so you guys won't bloody spam me. Sorry, don't trust, I don't trust my viewers. <laughs> Okay, I think it's that easy, guys. Give it a little, give it a little try. Um, update feedback script to be fetch only. Actually, no, I didn't do that. I didn't quite do that. to remove this action. Okay, let's just quickly try this. Sorry guys, I'm boring you. But we need to disable the old form data style. Um, using uh, AWS API gateway lambda instead yeah do, 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 do. Do, 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 okay this might take a few seconds to to regenerate the wiki okay this looks good I 
I disable JavaScript still? Don't do that. <laughs> Should I have? That's why it's going wrong, guys. Okay, let's, let's study this. Hello, YouTube viewers. Oh, it looks good, man. Looks good. Looks good. See, that's what it's sending. Okay, I should probably say, well, it says 200. That's probably fine, really. Yeah, I got it. I got it going. A API gateway with Lambda. So next thing I'd probably do is get CloudWatch, maybe a nicer URL. And... Um, Maybe put some extra information like the navigator, window.location, document referrer. Play around with the usage plans, perhaps. Maybe lock it down a little bit. Oh, and it's not really locking it down. But make it so that you guys can't ha um, spam me too much. But yeah, that's how you do it, guys. I hope you enjoyed my, my floundering efforts there. And um, please give me a like. See ya. Bye.